Hi guys, hello, hello, it's Darzy Machaka Tour. Happy Thursday, how are you? <laughs> Happy pre-launch day. Well, I get to um, order today, I'm so excited. Any designer that got 100 PV last month gets to place an order today. So I'm really excited about that. Tons of cute things. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Just lots and lots. I'm having a hard time deciding what I need to get, honestly. I I feel like they need to show us it a whole week ahead of time so we can go through and take our time, but no. <laughs> well, I have to order this morning. Well, I don't have to, but I'm going to order this morning so that I can get some things coming our way. Look at these cute deer. Oh my goodness. These are going to be so cute. They have little bows on them. Uh, they have a little belt. Oh, I need gray paint. I forgot my gray paint. I'll grab some. Anyways, there are there's a small and a large. I'm gonna do them as a set. Do you guys want me to do them singly too? I put them as um, a set of two over on Shopify. I suppose I could do them, break them up if somebody wants to order the small one or the large one. And there's going to be trees. We just don't have time to do it all because I wanted to be able to show you some of the stuff. I'm hoping that my, my camera is going to cooperate. <laughs> I'm hoping I'm going to be able to, to go live with it. So um, if you're out there watching, just say hello so I know that I'm live. And... Make sure that you're sprinkling. Let me just share this over to VIP group. Oh, how was everybody? How was your day yesterday? How was your hump day, your Wednesday? How was it? <laughs> uh, I have my craft show set up today. So um, today is going to be a busy day. I get to do this project. Then I get to go and soon after that, um, we'll be able to order at 8 o'clock a.m., Pacific time, 9 Mountain time, 10 Central, 11 um, Eastern time. You'll be able to place an order if you're a designer that got 100 PV last month. And you should have got a little email from them too that tells you, hey, you get to do a pre-order. Um, if you are if you didn't qualify for it, then you're not going to see the new product when, it, when it's launch time. It's just not going to be there for you. So anyways, guys, tons of cute stuff. I posted, posted it on my page. Um... <laughs> And um, I don't even know what my favorite is. There's just way too many. Did do you guys have a favorite? Did you did you find something that was like stood out that you just have to have? I I saw so many things. <laughs> of course, I'll get one of everything so that I can show it to you guys. You know what? My I feel like it's shadowy in here today. I don't know why. Something feels different. <laughs> All right. Hi, Betty. How are you? Good morning. Hi, Doris, my sister. Happy Thursday. Hi, Sandy. Hi, Tony. Hello, Denise. Hi, Lori. Good morning, Tina. Thanks for sprinkling. Hi, Karen Ross. Um, I need to revise your invoice for you still. Sorry, didn't get to that yet. Um, hi, Barb. Hello, Holly. Hi, Janine. How are you? Um, <laughs> the deer are going to be so cute. There's a whole series. So um, this is a whole new month of projects for um we call it mistletoe they have mistletoe on their little bell um it's the mistletoe deer the mistletoe trees um there's gonna be ornaments there's gonna be a leaning ladder and a tiered tray that goes with it there is not a there's not a front door sign um but i probably could make one <laughs> That would be really cute. Hi, Sarah. How are you? Hi, hi, Carrie. Hi, Karen West. Oh, Tony, I'm sorry. Fighting a headache. That is not fun. I actually had a headache on the weekend for a, co a couple of days on the weekend um, during craft show. That was not a fun thing. <laughs> so um, craft show teardown. I had a headache and didn't have my medicine with me. It was terrible. Every time I bent over, I felt like my head was going to explode. Not a fun thing. Um, Tina said so many beautiful things coming. Yes, yes, and Sarah's excited to order. Yay! Hi, Cheryl. Good morning. Hi, Chris. And to scroll up really fast. Um, hi, Sandra. Gingerbread houses. Yes, I know. Because the houses can be painted really whimsically, and um, or you can do them just gingerbread. It's really cool. So if you didn't get to see the Launch Love Live, it's on the Chaka Tour um, on their corporate page and you can go back and watch that. Sorry, I got an itch. <laughs> Vintage set. Yep. Um, good morning, Yvonne. How are you? Hi, Karen Romanko. 
I love the deer are gonna be so cute. Hi Carrie, how are you? Hi Carol, good morning guys. All right, if you're not a designer, I would love if you would sprinkle this. Um, Carrie, ready to order and use your 15% off coupon? Yay! So, so Carrie, um, Carrie's a new designer. She she rejoined, um, so she gets her her 40% um, off of everything and her 15% off on top of that. Yay! That is so awesome. Um, so 55% off basically on everything that she orders. How amazing is that? And you could do that too, but um, you wouldn't qualify to order today. So if you join right now, you had to have had 100 PV last um, month. You'd have to wait till next week. So next week on Thursday, everyone can order. So, um, and all customers and all that. So I'm really excited. Let me see if I can, let me see if I can share this over. I don't know if I can. I was hoping that I was hoping that I could share my my screen. Let's see if I can do screen sharing, if it will let me. <laughs> Let's see here. Um, hard to know. Um, let's see. Share this device. Um, is it? Let me go over here to my display on iPad. There we go. Okay. Yay. <laughs> okay, let me see if I can share what I am seeing the holiday collection on my iPad. Let me see if it's going to let me. And you guys can see everything too. Um, it is just so nice and bright. Okay, um, here we go. All right, so I'm just going to scroll through. This is our holiday lookbook. So I'm just going to scroll through. Look at those. Look at those cute little nutcrackers. And here they are done up in a variety of colors. They have the cutouts with them. So these are vintage nutcrackers. And um, I'll put the link for this lookbook too. Check out this season's greetings transfer. This is large. This is an 18 by 24. I can't wait to do that. And then more of the cute little ornaments that are just really whimsical, well, actually vintage, vintage ornaments. So they have the cutouts for that. And then check out that Merry Christmas. Isn't that fun? That is such a cute little Merry Christmas. And the tree, the little tree that fits on, they have the cutout. Um, and they also have digital files available for a lot of these. Um, I don't know if you can see the little postcard on the left-hand side. That's a small one. Actually, that's a size B. It's <laughs> surprising me the size of some of these things. So um, they have cutouts for the Merry Christmas. They have a ton of cutouts. Okay, so they're, they're competing with those cutout people now. <laughs> and here's the little bag with the, with the Holly Jolly Santa Claus. How fun is that? I love that. And um, the, the tote bag is new, so that's available. Um, the little, the little um, box, what do I want to say? Shadow box. Shadow box was delayed in shipping, so that's not going to be here right now, but it should be here in a few weeks. And then this is the Christmas um, tiered tray from last year, so they're just bringing all of that back. And then check this out. They now have a tassel maker. And I can't see comments at the moment, but go ahead and comment and tell me what you love the best. Um, so they have a tassel maker, so they put tassels on this pillow. This is a chocolate pillow, and check out that that design. The it, holiday tool pattern has cute, cute, cute stuff on there. There's even a little Santa on there. I think it's adorable. And then this is a kit. So this is a tray kit that you can make with your kiddos, grandkids, neighbors, nieces, whoever. Um, and it comes with everything. So it comes with the transfer, the chalk paste, the tray, and a squeegee and a little color tray. So that's a kit, that's a new kit. And then um, look at this, all these bright colors. Okay, so they have they have a new palette pack if you wanna use those bright colors. Um, it looks like it's couture, coral, couture teal, gold, um, shimmer, shimmer, um, probably the, the green is shimmer olive, tide, and candy apple. So those are really cute. I love, I love the bright colors. What do you guys think? <laughs> Tell me, are you guys seeing all of this? Tell me that you're, I think that you're seeing it. It's on the screen. So, okay, so you're seeing all this. And then they have, um, they have mini little coaster. Is that what they said? They had mini coasters. I thought that's what they said. They have mini coasters. 
now. <laughs> and then the trees. They have these trees. So they have the wooden trees. The wooden trees are available. It's a set of three. Um, comes with a stand and the little base. And then all the cute little things. I know the tray kit's really super cute. And then check out these bottle brush um, trees. Now these are really popular. Bottle brush, brush trees have been popular for a while. Um, I know, I love that. I love that. So um, I'm going to keep scrolling. And the cutouts over there on that side, I could point to it, but I can't because... <laughs> because I'd be pointing to the screen and then the flip sign look at the little little um this is a size c transfer on this so very merry um and then they've cut it up and done it's lit and holiday and feeling jolly is one of the other ones and check out that tote bag isn't that cute with the with the jolly it's called jolly ornaments so those are kind of retro um retro vintage ornaments I love those those will be cute just made up so I would cut those out and hang those on my Christmas tree too. And then this is another kit. So this is called a neighbor kit. So um, we give we give away little gifts to our neighbors. So this would be perfect. You can put anything you want in there. Cookies. They've put a little hot chocolate um, kit and then um, a little uh, spice kit to, that makes things smell nice. So that's a kit that's kind of like the Valentine's kit that we have. And then this is the gingerbread house that someone was saying they love. This is two sets, okay? So this is done up all nice and whimsical, all the colors, but um, you can do it just um, camel and white. So it looks like gingerbread house. So it's two different sets. The pricing isn't on here. This is just all the pretty colors. So there's two different transfers, two different sets if you want to do the whole great big thing. And then um, check out this pattern here, the 12 by 18. It's called a Nordic pattern and on that um, cute little pillow. Isn't that sweet? <laughs> and then the tags. So there's two different minis. Um, those are, That's so cute. It says, oh, oh, so bright. Um, super fun. Tons of fun stuff, guys. I love this. Happy holidays. That's a size B transfer. The ho ho ho. Okay, so the wreath piece, um, that is a new thing. The wreath with the wood in the center, that is a new, um, that's a new surface. And then here we go. So have the little cutout. I, I don't know if they actually have that cutout or if they cut that out. Some of the things they're just cutting out with paper. Um, hi Bridget, how are you? I know I love the neighbor kit too. Sorry, I'm just, I'm looking, I'm still looking. And then the cute little cards, those are fun cards. I think those are the same ones. I think they brought back the cards um, from last year. This is fabulous. I love the reindeer games with the cute little reindeer um, cutouts. Those are available. So that's a 12 by 18 size transfer. And then those reindeer are pretty decent sized. How fun is that? Okay, and then the joy piece. Um, family believe kind of Christmas that is the lots of love transfer so when you purchase that transfer um, two dollars of that is going to go to lots of love and then check out the one that has um, that's large it's an 18 by 24 so they're bringing back some of their large um, transfers and that has all the words jingle bells cozy fires snowflakes warm mittens hot cocoa all this stuff and then of course a directional sign here Christmas reindeer road candy candy cane lane snowman street how fun is that <laughs> just so just so much it's so much to look at guys there is so much and then the the naughty and nice sign is really cute on the flip signs i need to get some more flip signs <laughs> and they have the cutouts for naughty and nice of course they do and then they brought back the reindeer the ornamental reindeer and then there's that surface again that has the the piece that's removable that you can swap out so that's the hoop wreath and there's little sayings like um merry and bright have yourself a merry little christmas oh what fun um fa la la <laughs> and then check this out here's the angel and they do have the they have the wings available for the angel so um you can make it 3d like and then look at that gorgeous stained glass nativity <clears throat> that is amazing what they did they etched that on with etching cream and then they went and they colored it so that is amazing I love that <laughs> just way too much guys I don't even know what to say there's just so much here and then this tray this tray is super cute with all the little 
all the little colorful um, leaves and snowflakes and all that. And then Hanukkah, this is great for Hanukkah. Um, I know that we have people um, that are Jewish that they like being able to have something like this. I have a friend that always buys something from me that is Hanukkah. Um, themed. Okay, and then this is new. So this is a tear tray. It's a winter tear tray. Snow, um, sweater weather. How fun is that? That's really super cute. And then here we go. Ski lift. I mean, gosh, these are just some really cute things. These would be fun up in my cabin. <laughs> and then the, the pine cones, um, winter cheer. And then this one, say, say it ain't snow. <laughs> That's so funny. And then there's um, snowflakes. The ice skating rental, I, there's just way too much. And we're not even at the end yet. We're, we're getting close to the end. But gosh, guys, there is a lot. And they brought back the literally freezing transfer. And then there's a transfer that has six, is a size C that has all the different things on it. Ski chalet, um, hand cut firewood, um, like mountain, mountain skiing type things. And then um, colors, It's they didn't bring new colors in. These are the same colors. This is just all of our colors that we have. And then it that's the end. Okay, so <laughs> what do you think? Okay, let me try to, let me try to put you back to me. There we go. What do you think, guys? That is so much. <laughs> so, so much. Okay, I'm going to shut my little iPad. And I need to plug in my glue gun because we're going to need it. <laughs> All right. So I took up a few minutes with that. So we're going to make up the time. We, um, we have a pretty short project. But I do have to be done in time to order. And then almost right after that, I have to leave. <laughs> so tons and tons of goodness here, guys. Let me put myself up in the corner. What's your favorite? There's just too much. There's a, there's just, I'm, I'm looking at it going, I am totally overwhelmed. There is so much to look at. <laughs> I just, I just sit there going, holy cow. I just love it all. I don't even know what to focus on first, but I will, for, for designers, we have a button where we can do buy one of everything. So you can buy one of all of the transfers and one of all of the surfaces. So I will be doing that. And then I'll be going back and putting a second order in for um, things for you guys. So I always make sure that I have have um, orders in so that in case they sell out. And then we're also doing the punch of cups. So over on the VIP group, if you want to get in on that, <laughs> I need to take on this tomorrow. Tomorrow, not today. Um, <laughs> the, the punch of cup is going to be coming up, um, but I just have to see, I don't have a date set because I have to wait and see how quickly they're going to ship. So I don't know how quickly they'll ship everything. All right, I need to get some gray. We'll get everything painted. Oh, I need green too. Turlene, ah, I'm slacking on my colors. Um, where is my green? Um, light avocado or I want a lighter green. Aloe is a good color. Aloe is a good color and then gray. I need gray for the bell. Okay, all right, I think there's a little bit in that. <laughs> this is so cute, the bottle tree. I love the bottle tree. The, the angel, the village. Oh yeah, just so much. Okay, so we have our little, that's our little mistletoe. And then the bell underneath, here's a snowflake, here's a snowflake, snowflake, snowflake. Do the bells. Okay, all right, let me make this a little bit smaller so you can see everything. <laughs> Maybe not quite that small, it's okay though. All right, so so many things. I know I'm in trouble too. I want everything. <laughs> well, I do have to get one of everything. So that's, I just have to because of it being a business. So that's, that's something that I just have to do. Okay, so let's get started. We're gonna paint our deer. Our deer is gonna be painted cocoa. I actually would like a different color, but I don't have it. And I won't be able to stop and grab any at the Hobby Lobby because I'll have my trailer behind my truck and I can't pull in. The parking lot's not big enough to pull in and turn and have a place um, to park even at the very end. We're going to paint the base um, dark chocolate. Okay, so we have dark chocolate here. I do need a palette dish, but I don't have one out yet. Let me see if I can. I think I have one here. Here's a great big one. We'll use a great big one if we need to. <laughs> okay, so so dar um, dark chocolate is going to be the base. This is a pretty easy project, so I think we can get through this, and I'll still have plenty of time. 
Whew. craziness, crazy, crazy, craziness. Just always stuff going on. I have my craft show set up and I'm doing it by myself again. Yeah, it's really sad. <laughs> <laughs> I really need to have a helper, but I don't have one and it will be fine. It was, it's just going to take me all day. So I, and I do have all day so I can stay there. She stays till late because some people don't even come until after, after they get done with work. So she's usually there till nine o'clock. I can get there at nine and I'll probably leave at nine o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a very long day for me today. Um, can you use some prayers? I'm still having problems with the swelling and now have sore throat. Oh gosh, I'm so sorry. Um, Karen, yes, um, we will definitely say prayers for you. Are you going to go back into the doctor? I, I hope that I hope that you are not getting an infection. That's what I worry about is that it would be an infection. Gosh. Um, Laura says you love all the detail. I love all the detail too. So hi, Carol. How are you? I know some people, um, <laughs> some people uh, hopped on while I was showing all the pictures. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry if I didn't say hi. Um, yeah, Laura, I need some help. I need some help <laughs> in more than one way. Okay. So this is Coco. Um, I would prefer a different brown. I might redo some but you know what i'm just taking this to my craft show what we'll do is i'll do the there's little trees that go with it i'll do the trees tomorrow and then i'll take them to my craft show tomorrow because i'll want to take pictures of the little deer with the trees so i will i will have to wait and do all that okay let me get all my make i might i need more paint <laughs> I did not get enough. Um, so I'll be choosing a different color. I'm not sure what color. I think this will be fine though. This kind of looks okay. This doesn't look like it. This is not a bad deer color. I think they're really cute. Super cute. All right. Well, and I found more stuff to take to my craft show. I had a cabinet um, in my living room that I just keep stuffing things in the bottom of the cabinet and in the drawers I pulled out all my stuff you guys would be proud of me that I am parting with a lot of things <laughs> a lot of my stuff that I just keep storing you know I'm, I'm actually parting with it I'm parting with my Ray Dunn mugs and all my little Ray Dunn decorations all my little Christmas things Christmas cups um, the bulbs that hang on Christmas trees that are Ray Dunn I sold a ton last week and I found more stuff. <laughs> I found Halloween stuff in my little cabinet. Okay, so that's Coco. All right, so let's do our snowflakes. We're gonna do our snowflakes white. I am just finished antibiotics last, oh, uh, you don't wanna take them again. Oh my goodness, that is, I'm sorry. That is really hard. Yeah, when it, when it has anything to do with the mouth, you have to be so careful though. And I know you will. I know you will. And I know your daughter is going to be watching over you too. Because I know she helps you out with stuff. So I'm going to pray that you are not having another infection coming. Okay. So I do need white for little dots on it. And we're, we're going to speckle it white. Not, we're not going to speckle with black. We're just going to speckle with white on these. Okay. So our snowflakes are white. We're going to do our little um, mistletoe that hangs on their neck. We're going to do that with aloe. Aloe's a great color. It's a good, it's a good mistletoe color. There probably is a color called mistletoe. <laughs> I don't have one though. So I'm going to put my paint up there and more brushes, please. More brushes. I have a whole box of brushes guys. Cause I, when I was painting last week, I just kept putting them on the counter and I was spreading them out. I had so many brushes in the kitchen and then it came time for Audrey to come and clean. <laughs> And so I had this box of just, I have a whole little box flat full of all of my brushes. I have a ton. Okay, and then we're going to use our, our gray is going to be slate gray. Okay, and there's got to be a little bit left in here. <laughs> just a little bit. I don't need very much. <laughs> That's probably enough. So... All right, so if you're a designer and you're gonna order this morning, um, go on early. Make sure that you are going on early because they, the last few times, they uploaded everything early. So I'm gonna plan to do that. <laughs> I'm gonna plan to go on a little bit early 
and then I have to be at my craft show set up by nine, which is only 15 minutes away from here, which is great. Um, but I have to be done with my orders. So my biggest problem is figuring out what to order for you guys. Hi, Vicki, how are you? You're gonna wanna go back and see. I showed all of the new stuff. So you're gonna wanna go back and see that. I did post pictures too. Oh, you, you probably have it all in your email. So I, I showed the lookbook. So um, I'm sure that you saw it in your email since you're a designer. Um, we kind of went through everything. What, what was your favorite thing? I have so many favorites. I love the angel too. There's a little hair there. <laughs> Darlene's shedding on hair. We're making our little deer today. These are so cute. There is a hair. There we go. Okay, I need to touch up just a little bit on this. <coughs> just a little bit of touch up on my dear. Oh my dear. Okay. Um, I don't. I don't think I need a second coat. I think it's going to be okay like that. All right, let me just dry right up on the face. We need to do the nose. We need to do the feet. We need to do um, some shading. There's um, little white berries on the mistletoe. Okay, so there's a few things here and there. Let me look at my cheat sheet. Oh, I need black. Of course I do. <laughs> I need black for the hooves and the nose we're not do we are not doing the nose red okay so um no red nose for this deer we're going to use brown okay so i need a little bit of brown and then i do need white some more white for for some dots on them we're going to do we will be doing inky okay so i need some black for the hooves some white for the dots on here and we'll be doing a little bit of shading on our bell. You watch the launch. Oh, I, yeah, the launch was great. Um, the deer sheet, you should add a touch of white to the bottom of the tail. Yes, I could do that. Um, I could do that. I'll see if I'm going to do that or not. <laughs> I, do I do have the little white. Um, I can do it with, the mark with a, a brush, too. I have the little white ink pad, too. Let me just get some brushes out, which I didn't do yet. And we're gonna do our little things that we need to do here. I have my stylus. I can do the little white dots on here with my stylus. I can do the nose with that. Okay, so white berries on our holly, or no, mistletoe, on our mistletoe, sorry. It is not holly, it is mistletoe, and those go around their neck. I know, these are so cute. So there's a, there's a whole series. There's a there's ornaments that go with this set. There's tear tray. There is um, what else? What else did I say? Oh, there's a cute little little hanging sign. There's trees. There's not a, a French porch leaner, but I could design something. Let me get a paper towel. Okay, the nose, I think I wanna just do the noses with, with the stylus too. So I'm putting dark chocolate on the nose. And then the hooves, I think I'll just do, I'll do the hooves um, with black and I'll use a brush. Okay, so styluses work great for, for little small areas like this. There we go. How fun is this? Next time um, you should be a guest designer to show up. <laughs> Aw, thanks Laura. I would love to do that. Um, I I was on um, one of the corporate pages recently. That's um, the you know they choose they choose people that they want to choose. <laughs> the people that they chose, two of the people that they chose, um, I know them really well, and they have been um, with the company for a long time, and also they are like at the top of the company on sales and and. <laughs> You know, it just depends. I, I know that for for Brenda Durant, she lives right there. They wanted somebody to be right there in the studio. So that was pretty awesome that she, she was able to be right there. Um, Debbie, Debbie is the top salesperson in the entire company. 
So she's number one in sales in the company. Um, I'm up there. I was I was number was I number four or five in the company as far as sales. Um, I can't remember what it was. Number number four or five. So Debbie Debbie is already over five million dollars in sales, which is a lot. But she comes with a background of having, she had a lot of customers um, online before. She has over a million people on her Facebook page. So she has a huge, huge following. She, she, she kind of had that already. So it was a little bit easier for her to transition into the sales part. Okay, now we're gonna do, we're gonna do little dots on the, on the butt, okay? And what are we gonna, we're gonna do some shading. What else do I need to do? I'm looking at my cheat sheet. <laughs> so we're just going to do some some dots on there um four i'm not sure what was the four 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 the number four did i ask a question <laughs> i'm not sure what the number four is for um all right i'm going to go ahead and there's going to be some little white dots on there but I'm trying not to make them in a line. I'm trying to make them a little random. There's just, and how far does it go out? Like up to there and then there. Something like that. Something like that. <laughs> so, so it's just some little white dots here. I know. I love watching it. I love seeing all this stuff and they're, they're so funny. And our, you know, we just, we just have a great team over there. I love our corporate team. Julia is amazing. She's in charge of all of the, all the designs. Okay, that looks good. I think maybe just a couple more. You know how you're like, oh, just a couple more, just a couple more. <laughs> all right, and then I'm going to dry. And then we're going to speckle. You were number four. Oh, thank you. I was number four. Yeah, I think I was number four. <laughs> I have my little trophy out there. I could go look on the trophy. <laughs> Isn't that funny? I can't, I, I couldn't remember. It was because, well, in one year I was number two, which surprised me. I was shocked. It was like my second year with the company. I hadn't even been there two full years and I was, I was number two in sales. It was amazing. <laughs> yeah. Craziness. I've always, I've always been in the top ten, just because I try so hard to always every single day. I do a project every single day. I'm selling their product. I do lots of craft shows, so I have all of that um, that I'm taking the product to. Oh, I gotta touch this up. I've got a little white dot right here. We're gonna fix that. So, but I do do other things. Um, they haven't always allowed us to do other things. You know, sometimes, um, once upon a time, we couldn't do other things like this unless it had Chocotour on it. So, uh, so things have changed. The, the company has, has changed how they needed to do. Oh, I need black, not, not brown. <laughs> Let me get just a tiny bit of black to fix that. And then um, we're going to speckle after we glue everything together. We got a shade though, too. <laughs> Isn't it funny how it's like, what question did I ask? <laughs> how many years have you been doing Chocolate Tour? I've been with them five years. Um, in August, it was five years. So, and I love it. I, you know, you guys, I really do love doing Chocolate Tour. Uh, but I love other stuff too. Here's what I love most is that I can combine it with everything else that I do. So, um, so the little trees that we're doing tomorrow, I'm going to throw some Chocotour patterns onto them. And probably some of the other things that we do, some of the signs that we do for the, um, with this design, I'm going to throw some Chocotour patterns on. I love to combine Chocotour with what I already love. I love wood. Okay. Wood, wood is my thing. <laughs> wood has always been my passion. I, uh, like I, I've said before, I was in wood shop. I think I'm going to use a Q-tip for part of this. It's kind of hard to get in. We'll see. Let me see how I can do. Um, I was in Woodshop because I wanted to be in there with all the guys. And I actually learned something now. 
So and the funny thing is that sometimes you just do things for other reasons and you end up learning something from it. Because <laughs> I thought, well, gosh, you know, Woodshop is a great class. I can be in there with all the guys and I can help them with their projects, which I did. A lot of times um, my teacher would say, well, where's your project? So it's like, well, I'm so busy helping so-and-so and, and sanding and holding the, this while they're, while they're gluing and nailing. <laughs> He's like, you have to have it. Oops, I just dropped my e-pad. Hang on a second. Hold, please. <laughs> Where did it go? Oh, my goodness. Um, I'm going to be down here on the floor for a second finding my e-pad. I think it went under the table. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, my gosh. I actually can't see where it went to. That was funny. Okay. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> I'm going to have to go from the other side. I don't want the dog grabbing it. The ink pad, the ink pad just jumped off the table. I'm going to go down on the other side. It went underneath. <laughs> no, Chloe. Oh, Chloe has it already. <sighs> Chloe, look at me. <sighs> you guys. Oh, no. I thought she had it on her forehead. It's not. She was over there. She was looking at it like, what is that? I think it jumped off the table underneath. <laughs> and she's in the corner and she's like, what is that? All right. I was just getting so excited about everything. But yeah, I, I ended up learning a trade. I ended up how to use all the tools um, in the wood shop. And that was a great thing. And I was with all the guys. <laughs> Okay, um, I'm just going to ink around all of my little deer. I don't know that I'm going to give it a white tail, but you totally could do that. It is up to you. Let me see if I can get in there. It seems to be working okay. I'm just going from one side to the other, just switching it around. So ink, 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 and then we're going to glue it together, and then we will do some speckling on it. How fun is this little project? I love this little deer. It is so adorable and there's no eyeball. So it's kind of retro type style to me. I, I do, have, um, I do some, I have some ideas for painting for the other parts of it. And I'm gonna do um, retro colors on some of it. Just gonna ink around this. I'm not gonna ink around the, the um, I need to do that. Probably need to ink right there. I'm gonna get out a Q-tip. That's gonna be better. So I'm gonna use a Q-tip on that. Okay, so I'm going to get some ink on my Q-tip and I'm going to ink right here. Just put some, put a little shading right in there. You can use a brush. If you want to use a brush and do your shading, absolutely can do that. That's too much. Okay, I don't like that. I'm going to grab, <laughs> I would rather have none than have that line like that. Um, let me see if I can just kind of make it so it's not so dark. <laughs> We're just taking it all away. Okay. Um, I'm going to try again. So I'm going to try just really lightly. I wasn't paying attention. I just want a little fine line there. There we go. The, the tip of the, <laughs> the tip of the Q-tip, not the side of it, Darlene. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Let's try it with the other one too. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, just pop them in there. I am always happy to answer your questions. Um, if you need help with anything, um, talk to tour wise. If you can't, I always suggest reach out to your upline. If you if you can't get help from your upline, I can answer questions. Today, I'm not gonna be much help because I'm not gonna be around. So if you send me a message, um, then I'm not gonna be around. You can ask on your team page you need to find out who your upline is that has a bigger team page, okay? So sometimes, sometimes um, your upline might not be somebody that's active. It might just be somebody that you chose because you wanted somebody in a town by you and you didn't know that they were just in it for the discount also. <laughs> and so when it comes for questions, then you're not getting your questions answered because they don't know, they don't follow everything. So if you are in that situation, reach out to the upline about that. There's always going to be somebody above that is going to be able to help you. 
Um, all of the lines have great people at the top that can help you with the things that you need. But I am there for you. Um, I help a lot of people with stuff. I'm always happy to do that. Today's not going to be that day because I'm not going to be here. <laughs> Hi, Linda. How are you? Okay, let's glue these together. And we then we're going to speckle. We're going to do our white. We're not going to do black this time. We're just doing white. We want it to just be kind of bright. And this is just one layer. So sometimes, sometimes these are two layers. It's just one layer with, um, you know, the base underneath, underneath it. Sometimes. It's not so big. If they're really tall, I generally would do more. Like the trees, I might add. I'll see if they're bendy. If they're too bendy, then I'll put another thing in there. Okay, so that's the base. Those go right there. And then we're going to glue. We're going to glue these parts together and then put them onto our little deer. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> how fun are these oh my gosh I just love them and they're gonna look cute with some of that new chocotour stuff I just know it I just know it <laughs> okay and we'll glue a bow on there after so we want to speckle before we glue the bows on you know I've done it the other way around because I forgot <laughs> this goes up on the neck. Let me see how far you want to leave room for the bow. So it's going to go about right in there. Okay. And then we do have little snowflakes that go in there. I love stuff like this. I just, I just adore it. I just, <laughs> it's just so fun. I could do like a whole little village with these guys. They're like little, little winter scene. And I could do different sizes too. So I may I may scale them down and do smaller sizes. These are pretty big. I don't even know how tall, like eight inches tall? Maybe maybe bigger than that. Okay, teeny tiny um, snowflake goes onto, onto the, oh, it goes in the center. Oopsie, oopsie, it goes right there. <laughs> oh, that one actually goes on the little one. Sorry. That one, the small one goes over here. There's two, two smaller snowflakes. The smallest one goes on the little, on the smaller deer. Stand up. And then these go on their butt area, kind of, sort of. Kind of like right in here. And kind of like that. One there. One on the other side. Or on the other deer. Okay, and then we're going to speckle. So let me move this stuff. Let's kind of dry that. I'm gonna, I want that glue to be dry in there. So let me just try to do that really quickly. Yes, Mary Lee, I'm, I am your upline. Yes. So whoever you joined under is your upline. So that's the person that you need to ask all the questions. So I, yeah, there's always, there's always, ton, there's a ton of people watching, um, because they don't always have somebody on their team that does Facebook lives and they need to learn. Okay. So I'm always here to, to teach you guys, but I do love painted stuff. I do painted stuff all the time. I try to throw chocolate tour on everything, not on this. It didn't work out on the deer. <laughs> Let me get some paper towels. My paper towels are buried. Let me see if I can pull them out. That didn't work very well. <laughs> okay, so I do need to tie little bows and put them on there. And we're looking good with time. It's not even 7.30 yet. It will be by the time that we're done. It'll be 7.30, then I can clean up. And then I can go about ordering. And then I'll be heading out to go do my craft show. Okay, so we're going to speckle. So we need to bring back our little deer. Oh, dear, where are you? And our deer, our little deer, our big deer, our bases. Okay, so we're gonna speckle with white. And I do have white paint already. And I do have a paintbrush or a toothbrush here. So just gonna scooch that over just a little bit. We're gonna speckle. That just means putting little dots on there. Okay, so little dots. Have a paper towel for my fingers and one for the paint. So I usually fold it up several times because it's gonna get a little messy when you are um, dabbing that. Let's get some water in there. So there's my water. And 
Take your toothbrush, dip it in the water, on a paper towel, in the paint, on a paper towel, in the water, on a paper towel. Tap, tap, tap. Okay, you don't want big, big dots. So I'll, I'll start out on the base part. Okay, they look good. <laughs> you don't want great big large dots. Okay, so you're going to, I might do it a little bit. Um, let's do a little bit bigger than that. So I added a little bit of water and then, okay, that looks good. You just kind of want a fine misting of it. Okay, so you can go back and you can add more if you need to have more on your brush. You want a little bit bigger dots so it shows, but I really want a lot on there. So I want it to be really, really speckled with white. Let's get the tail part. Okay, isn't it cute? That is super cute. We're gonna dry this, we'll add the bow, and we'll put them in the stand. We'll glue, we'll glue them in their stand. Let me move this. I usually will just dab up that water so I don't spill it. Cause you know, <laughs> you know how I am. <laughs> oh, I hope he's still on his fishing trip. He is. Um, yeah, he he's out till Sunday. So I know. Um, yes, that's that's a good point, Lori has been watching forever. She's a designer, but not on my team, but um, I always try to help everybody. Hi, Mara, how are you? Oh, you're welcome for the happy mail. <laughs> so all of my club people got their little happy mail. If you didn't get it yet, it's on its way. It's just sent out, it's not first class anymore. It's called Ground Advantage. So it takes as long as it takes. Sometimes it would take a whole week. They changed things. <laughs> so so they took away priority and now it is ground advantage. So they combined, what they did was they took, um, they took ground and they took, pri um, uh, what I would say, <laughs> first class. They took first class and ground and they combined it and now it's ground advantage. So that's what they did. So it's, it costs more, <laughs> it costs more on some of the things. <laughs> I know, aren't they so cute? So now we're gonna add a bow. I actually ordered some other ribbon. This is quarter inch. I, I really would like to have three eighths. My three eighths is on its way, but um, it's gonna work for right now. So so the small one will have a, a thinner bow and then the large one will have a, a bigger bow. So I will give you ribbon for each in the kit. And then the trees will be coming tomorrow. You might want to wait to order till you see the trees, or you can go ahead and order the trees and I'll be painting them tomorrow. <laughs> so you can order both. I just like to save you guys on shipping. I, do, I don't like the fact that shipping costs so much to begin with. And there's many, many times that um, we don't even get our shipping covered. You know, all right, our shipping ends up costing us out of pocket on things. So, it depends on where it goes. If it's in state here, then we usually are right on the money um, or like a surrounding state. Like we can ship to Nevada, Oregon, um, Utah, Idaho, pretty, um, not, not inexpensive, but for less and Texas too. So there's a few states that are close. And now when we ship to New York, it always costs like three or $4 more um, than it costs to ship here in this state and we're always we always lose about two dollars on those orders <laughs> new york and florida the furthest ones away because it just it costs more because the fact that um it's further away so even like first class first class for places like that is six dollars now instead of four dollars it is ridiculous. Okay, there's my little bow. I'm just kind of fussing with it. I'm just going to do it at an angle instead of doing a, um, the, yeah, that other cut. <laughs> I'm just going to do it at an angle. Okay, let me see if that looks good. Okay, so that's just going to go right there. It's actually going to go down onto, I want to make sure that I'm, it's not going to move. Okay, stay. Let me, let me look at, actually, I don't even have my cheat sheet. It went somewhere. It jumped. It jumped somewhere. It's just going to go right here. I'm going to actually glue it down onto the wood. 
I think. I don't think I want to glue it at the top because then that part doesn't show. Yeah, I got my hot glue gun. You're wanting to do the same thing. Um, oh, you have an art center in Tehachapi, and yesterday you rented wall space and set up stuff to sell. Oh, that's awesome. First time, so that is really cool. Congratulations. I, you know what? That's how I started with crafts, <laughs> was in a little, not in an art place, but selling at the ball. I rented a spot, and I, it was actually commission. So for me, commission was better than paying rent because if I didn't sell anything, <laughs> then I wasn't out. That looks so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm putting the glue onto the ribbon itself and just trying to be really careful in placing it. I don't want to stick my finger in glue because that always hurts. It hurts for a couple of days. I got some mosquito bites yesterday and I pulled out, I pulled out my mellow look at oil this morning to put on it <laughs> i can't believe i got mosquito bites oh my gosh and then it worries me because they actually um one of my friend's friends here has malaria from mosquito bites from here they have malaria <laughs> i'm like what the heck are you kidding me and she's like nope nope they got malaria from um down at the river walking at the river getting bit by mosquitoes I didn't know that we had malaria here in California. I did not know that. <laughs> the rent is 20, that's not bad at all. Um, that That is really a good price. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this into here. Our little, oh, there's some glue that, that went popping out. <laughs> so just sop that up if there's extra glue that comes out. Just take your paper towel so that you don't have like a big bubble of glue right there. This is looking so cute. The little base is really cute too. I'm glad I did it brown. You could do it green if you want to. You could totally do it any color that you want. It is up to you. Okay, and I just moved my little, my little bell. Oh my goodness, it's so adorable. I'm loving this. <laughs> Let me just get some of my glue cleaned up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lay this down so that um, the base is not wobbly. I'm gonna make sure that I lay it down so that it is going to be flat. Okay, all right, looks good, looks good. Super cute, guys, so excited. Okay, let me put you up to myself. <laughs> light brown, yeah, the, I think that light brown was a perfect color, that was cocoa. Um, so cocoa was, cocoa was the color. And I just need to clean up a little bit of the glue that keeps coming out of the hole. <laughs> Aren't these adorable? How fun is this? How fun is that? That is so cute. <laughs> Let me just kind of, yeah, they're a set. So, so there's two of them. Yep. Um, I can do them singly. I, I listed them as a set. Okay. So... Um, but I could list them single if, if you just want one. But I think they're just too cute to have two of them together. <laughs> and then there'll be trees. So tomorrow I'm going to do trees and I'll take a picture. Um, 20, per, 20 per foot. Okay, I understand. Yeah, that's not bad at all. I know, aren't they so sweet? Okay, guys, I have to get going because I got to order. I got to clean up my brushes. Got to go hop on. I like to hop on 15 minutes early just in case things post early, which they have been lately. <laughs> All right. And then I'm going to go set up my craft show. So busy, busy day for me. Hope you guys are all doing good and have a wonderful day. Let me know if you have questions. I know. Aren't they so sweet? Throw me some hearts. If you love it, give me some hearts. I would love some hearts. I'm going to give myself some hearts. There we go. <laughs> All right, I love you guys. I will see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful day. Bye.